We want to make a stencil of the American flag. Since the flag has three colors in it, I made three squares. Each one of those is a piece of, of Cricut vinyl that we're working with. So let's click on your flag and go up here and ungroup it. And now that's going to let me work with each layer separately. I can just go in the layer tab and tell it I want to work with the white layer and hold down the shift key on my keyboard and click on the red and it unselected those. Let's just do that again. There we go. I want to work with those two layers and then I want to slice. So now what it's going to do is slice the white and the red, which gives us a red piece that looks like this. Okay, so now let's click on that blue piece and we're going to arrange it and pull it to the front. Now we're going to want those little stars from the blue piece cut out of the white. So we'll select both of those. And you see this time I did it with the window instead of picking on them. And you know what? I just noticed there's a sliced piece under here. So I'm going to go over here and delete that. Oh, oh that duplicate. <laughs> and this just shows how you can mess up and fix it. Okay. I want to delete that piece that's under there. Okay. Window around there and slice. And now I have a white piece that has the stars on it. Awesome. There's another white piece under there that we don't need so we can get rid of it. Now for the blue, we just want it to be a rectangle of blue because we're going to layer the white over the top and do the stars. So now we're going to go into contour and my design space is being a little slow. So contour allows you to click on all of the images inside of the cut or the layer and turn them on and off. So I'm going to click on each one of these stars. And as I'm doing this, you can kind of look over here and you can see the stars start to turn off. So I'm just going to keep clicking. Or you can click over in here. Either way, get you there. Or you probably could have clicked hide all contours. Let's just do that. And close it. Sorry, this video is going to be long, but my design space is just not going smooth tonight. So bear with me. Okay, so there's my blue. So now, I want to make these into a stencil. So I'm going to select the blue and the one square and go slice. So now I would cut this gray square with my Cricut and I'm going to use that as my stencil for the blue. I am going to do the same thing with these. Wow. Okay, design space is just not being my friend today. But that's okay, we will get there. I think they did an upgrade and now it's just being kind of choppy. So then once you have all of those sliced, you would cut them in design space, or sorry, come with your Cricut, and then you would use them to paint your stencil design. I hope this helped you figure out how to separate the color layers and turn them into a stencil. Thanks.